Hi everyone! So I'm going to be doing a video on Pet Talk. I think that's going to be the title I'm going to be using. So I, as you know, I already have Rami, my princess, the Pomeranian Chihuahua on the side, right? And we got a new puppy! His name is Rocky. Remy and Rocky. So he is a Labrador mix. It's kind of like a hound dog, but not a hound dog. So that's what he looks like. It's a boy. He's just wearing a pink collar because that's all we got. It's Remy's old one. And yeah, he is 11 weeks. Um, but people at the Petco, associates at the Petco said he's a little bit small, but he is a mixed breed. Ow. He likes to bite everything and he has really sharp teeth um, but yeah so 11 weeks new puppy in town his name is Rocky so I'm gonna be doing a like a little haul that what we've been using for this little mutt that we have first is first potty pads he is in the process of potty training and here you have it and we got this from Walmart it's the Potty Pad Simple Solution or Odor Defense, Odor, did I say that right? Odor Defense Floor Protective Pads. So he's been great with this so far. Um, we are parting trading him outside though, so every hour we'll go ahead and take him outside. Um, he's been doing great. I mean, he'll have occasions here and there we'll, where he will have an accident, but it's not like significantly. Sorry, they're stealing bones. It's not like significantly too much where we don't spot it and um, it's like a big puddle of urine. No, it's just like a little, probably like a smaller than a quarter size and then we will, and then we will bring them outside. So my dogs are being so crazy right now. But yes, number one, potty pads, what I need. We lay it out when he's, um, when it's nighttime when we have to isolate him when we are out out of the apartment. So the next the next item that I have is from Ross and it comes in a three a set of three but I don't know where the other one is. So it comes like these two a blue. The blue is for like um, dental cleaning any plaque it can remove that and this one is an edible bone and obviously you can see that Remy already ate half of it but it's not hers it's for the young one so and there's another one it's like a clear bone with a soft with it's a more smooth type of bone same size um, and that's just basically to help him you know with the itch through his gums when the tooth is gonna come out or just any teething um, craving or what is the word teething issues that he may have these bones should be able to help soothe them um, so that's that so that's that for those two bones I got those it was a set of three from Ross it was $5.99 stop and these things were from Petco we actually got them during Christmas and they've been great he's been loving this like he'll probably he'll try to tear these off but they're roped like really roped and tied in together so it takes him a while, you can have that. And the next one is like a pom-pom. He tries to tear this up, but obviously it's like sewed in together or something like that. So he doesn't really have a good chance of it. So you can have that as well. The next one is Kong Air Ball. Air Dog, sorry. So it looks like this. And there are three small balls. They're gentle on the teeth and gums. Uh, we just kind of throw it around. He is going to outgrow these, but I mean, as of right now, these are another toy. These are other toys that he can have. We do have a bigger version of one, and this is from Petco. But he can't really, you know, put wrap his mouth around it, so he prefers a smaller one. Um, the next item is poop bags. So when we're outside, we got to pick up our doggies business and we decided to get a poop bag this is from petco um i think this was no more than 15 dollars but it looks like this it's a poop bag 300 earth rated and they smell like lavender um i don't think it advertises that no it does extra long extra strong and lavender set so so they are in like a, a set of 300 and they're wrapped all together 
So right there, this is the one size and they're pretty long. So these compared to the ones at Ross, these are actually pretty long. Like these are actually longer than the ones that are given at Ross or Marshalls. And they smell good. They really do smell like lavender. And when you um, pick up their poop with the bag, you don't, it, it doesn't like eliminate all of their, the stench, but I mean, it covers it pretty well. So I really like these bags. They're actually cheaper if you get the 300 versus buying the, um, the smaller packs from Ross and Marshalls. So I, I recommend getting these. However, it does not come with the dog hand, what is this called, case, a dog case for you to put the plastics in. Um, you actually need to buy the, this individually. Um, and it, it does require a little more work because you kind of have to take this, fold it in half and then fold it again and then roll it up to actually put it in there. But I mean, it's worth it. If you want to save money, buy the 300 bags, just buy a small case. It's no more than what, $2 and put it, pop it inside just like so. Just pop it in there and you're set to go. Like it's really, 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 really easy. So that's for potty. Um, what's next? Another toy that we got is, oh gosh, we just got this yesterday and he's already tearing it up. As you can see, the yarn is kind of spread out there a little bit, but we got this from Ross. Ross? Yeah, I got this from Ross. It was $2.99. has a little squeaker. It looks like a tree with the leaves on the side. So he's been having a kick out of that. The next item is a leash. So this is a medium leash. I got this today at Target. This was $10.79. And the harness is pretty thick. And this is a five feet leash. Did I say harness? No, yeah, I did, but it's a leash. And it also has um, like an extra spot where you can tug them if you know, they're trying to pick something up on the grass, kind of tell them because it's really close to the lock where you hook it onto their collar. So it's a five foot leash, it's pretty sturdy. This one has a reflective material on it, so it'll be good for nighttime walks. And $10.79 at my local Target. Back to Petco, we got this. We, Eric assumed that he had some fleas. That's not. So Eric assumed that he has fleas because um, he has like white, white circular stuff that come out of his fur, but it's, I think it's just his dander. Like he just has dry skin. Um, so we, anyways, but we bought Esprit Flea and Tick Shampoo from Petco. I'm not sure how much this was, but we got it from Petco. Um, he used it yesterday. I don't know what it smells like. Like some type of candy. I don't know, some sweet candy, baby Starburst. It's like that kind of sweet. But he doesn't smell like that now. Nope, he doesn't smell like it, so the scent doesn't stay on. He just got a bath yesterday. He doesn't smell like that sweet scent. And yeah, I'm not sure how it works or how effective it is because we don't see any fleas on him, but we use it anyway. So if you use this, let me know if it works, if you like it, or what you recommend to get for fleas and ticks. Stop. Um, in addition to fleas and ticks, we are using Advantix. So we first got this for Remy and she is under the 11 and 20 pounds in this corner right here. And this was, I bought it off Pet Mints online and I believe it was on sale. So I think it was like $54, um, free shipping and handling. And I like this, I honestly, have been using it for the three years that she's been with me. Um, she hasn't had a problem with any fleas and ticks because she does go to the groomers often and they will tell you if they find one. So she hasn't had any. Stop it. Um, ouch. And hopefully this one doesn't have any 
He keeps biting my fingers and his teeth are so sharp. Go away. Here. Bed. We bought a bed for him as well. This was from Walmart. This was $6.88. But this was, no, wait, okay, I take it back. We bought this during December, early December. And Remy's been using it, but since now it's his, I just wanted to include it into the video. And now that's it. So we're gonna say bye. Um, if you guys have any recommendations on new dogs, like what I should invest in, or what I should, con yeah, what I should invest in, what I should consider buying him. This dog is crazy! But these are my loves. These are my two bubbas. This is Remy and Rocky. Okay. Ow, that hurt. Did you see that? He just bit her arm. Okay. Thank you for watching. Thumbs up. Please subscribe and I'll see you later.